In today's episode, you'll see what an angry daughter did to her family house simply because she had a tantrum. I am not the one! Quit looking at me like I'm a tant! Ah! A 16-year-old who started an argument and then attacked students and school staff. Don't try to think don't know. I'm too young! I'm too young to go to jail! Y'all don't understand! No! Please stop! Stop! The most entitled 18-year-old ever who didn't calm down even after being totally wrapped. Don't put your f***ing hand yeah, in my face. Get the f*** out of my f***ing right face! Don't touch me and don't put your hand I in my face. I ain't touching you! <laughs> yes, please stop! But first, you'll meet Catherine, the 12-year-old who constantly runs away from home because she can't stand her stepfather. One evening, she ran away to a friend's house and drank and partied with other teenagers. Her mother and stepfather found her and tried to take her home, but the situation escalated and aggressive teenagers even grabbed a machete to stop them. Hang out right here, bro. Keep your hands in front, man. Brother, keep your hands in front. Who? Okay, who else is here? Alright, so... I know, hold on, hold on. How many other people are here right now? Inside? Okay. Hey, everyone right here, bro. Hey, guys, do me a favor. Everyone just stay right there for me, okay? No arguing. If you continue to interrupt, I'm just going to detain every person that talks over me. So we came to come get her. And, um, girl with the black sweater comes and gets in my husband's face and is like, get out of his face. And the mom wound up going to the door trying to get into the house. So my husband and some other females all went and they saw the girls in the house and there's like all kinds of men, they're drinking and everything. Look, guys. If you continue to yell, we're gonna Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Raise your voice again, you're gonna be put in handcuffs. It's your last chance. You raise your voice, interrupt, or scream one more time, you go into handcuffs and you're sitting over there alone. We'll figure this out and we'll try to help you whatever we can, but if you don't help us, Take me away from her, you. that's all you need to do. Just take that's me away from her, she don't want me to take me away from her. I'm not touching you. I'm this dude named Steven needs to go out to jail for touching child abuse. Child abuse. There's grown men in there. I got you. And so they're trying to get in and get the girls, and one of the guys, I don't know which one it was, throws a beer bottle at my husband and the other lady, and they start swinging. And so they started fighting back. My daughter runs off towards the back. Uh, another lady walks up with a machete. Are you, did you run away from tonight? I didn't run away. I live? told him I was leaving. Your actual dad or someone that you can say? No, I want to go with my dad, my, my real dad. That dude came out one day and my mom decided to marry him. No, don't touch me. No. Stop. I'm not doing it. Ow, my nose! I'm gonna put you in my unit. I'm gonna put you in my unit. What? Um, put your feet in. Mister, can I just sit right here? Put your feet in. But why? You guys are gonna try to take me to jail. I don't want to go. I have to take care of my brothers. Why would we try to take you to jail? Because you guys always do the same shit. Every mm -hmm. time the cops come and I needed help, you guys took me. That dude did not knock me. at all. He started banging on the door. Him One of them did. And the other woman, the other girl that was here, they were banging on our door after I told them that they do not have any permission to go into our house. I told them mm -hmm. many times. Mister, I'm fine. Sit in my unit. I'm fine. Get your feet. Put them back in the no, unit. No, I'm fine. I'm telling you right now, you need to sit in the unit. Can I just be right here? I'm fine. No, I'm literally okay. doing nothing. You guys are so disrespectful. Talk about freaking listen to the law. I'm not doing nothing but yeah. hanging out with Take my friend. Seat. What's Her the relationship, to you? relationship between you and that and that man? I don't know him. I do not know him. Uh, they okay. tried going into okay. our house without our permission, All right. and they okay. started yelling, starting. Shit. Instead, instead of like approaching somebody, somebody civilized, right? Okay. You know, like so instead he's of starting stuff. In your home? 16 years old. You're 16? Okay. Based on these statements, it seems the situation was indeed tense, and the police arrived just in time. On one side, there are concerned parents who found their 12-year-old daughter surrounded with alcohol and men of various ages. And on the other side, we have scared teenagers who tried to stop adults from entering their house. Write in comments what you think about who is more in the right in this situation. And now Catherine will tell her story, but she won't be able to calm her temper, which will get her into more trouble. Because I'm fine! She took my. She lost. You can't make your own decisions. I can because I'm pretty responsible. Her and my dad want to be fighting later, earlier, but now she's all, oh, I want my daughter, I want my daughter, I want my daughter. But ever since, oh, your dad's nothing. But when I say something, it's, oh my god, I'm gonna call the cops on you. 
She should give me my phone and stop losing my stuff. Okay, take a seat. I'm fine. I'll take a seat. I need to talk to my supervisor right now. You can go talk to him. No, you need to sit out. I don't want yes, to. Take a seat. We'll roll down the window. You guys are being rude. I'm not being rude. This take my mom to jail. She's allowing to smoke weed and her boyfriend over there arguing um, and everything. Just take me away from her. I don't want to be with her anymore. Like, don't you guys understand that kids are being verbally abused? by their parents do you not listen to kids it's always the adults no, right listen, right not, not yes saying, it is because you guys don't right. do nothing i this is the third fourth fifth time that this happened you guys just need to listen for once listen to me if you don't if you guys take me rap, to a hospital you're gonna end up in the rap and you do not no want because to. you guys are going to put me in a hospital and i'm not going to go i get it no, you don't get it. You've never been it. through this. I don't want to go to the hospital, but if you don't sit down in there right now, it's going to be very uncomfortable for you in a little while. And I know you I'm don't want to be in the rap, fine. right? Take a seat I'm, in my unit. What am I doing? I'm just standing here. Is it against you're a not, lot of stand? I'm not listening to directions, okay? I'm just going to take a okay, seat. Okay, but you're not my boss. Just because you're a cop doesn't mean nothing. Okay, so this is my scene, right? So that means uh, I make the rules. No, it's okay? not. It's my scene okay. and my choices. I have seat. the rights to refuse. You take a seat. No, yes, I do. I know my rights and my wrongs. Don't get me started. I know my rights and my wrongs. Don't so touch me. <laughs> trying to not hurt you. So <laughs> you are obviously you. doing it, stupid. Use your brain, not your stupid ass. Why are you being stupid? In this part, Catherine had to be restrained because she started kicking, thus earning her first charge, battery on a law enforcement officer. Wait, 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 wait. I'll oh, do it. Let go of me. Let go of me. Let go of me so I can move. Lift your foot. I can't, stupid. Yeah. Move. I'm going to do it. Oh, let's see you so I'm gonna move. Gonna I'm going to do it. I can't I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it I'm stupid. stupid. I can't even look. Let me see first. Okay. You did it to yourself. No, I didn't, fool. I didn't put this I mean, Put you your do ass on the seat first. I can't, moron. Just leave me alone. No, get, in <laughs> get in there. Leave me alone. No. Yeah, I'm not doing awesome. nothing. Catherine, take a seat. You're going to end up in the I am taking a seat. All the way in the car. Why? What did I do? I want these off. I'll take them off. I'll treat you like an adult. But until then, I'll you need to get in there. I'll do it if you take it off no. me first. You haven't earned I'm that right. You how? haven't earned that yet. The way you're acting as a child on the floor, kicking and screaming and throwing a damn tantrum? Isn't that what kids are supposed to do? Well, now, if you're going to be acting like an adult, you want to be acting, treated like an adult, you want respect, you give respect. I do give respect. Why don't you use your brain? So, come on now. Why don't you guys take Stephen to jail? What did he do? Ready? I don't know who he's Stephen abused. is. He's abused. He abused me. First of all, he's not my dad. He's just married okay. to my mom. I have no problem He abused me. Do it. I will. But okay, I, well, listen to me first. He abused me. He abused a little girl over there. He abused my friend. I can't even get in. Like, I can't even stand up. You're not supposed to be able to stand wow. up. Wow. <laughs> Look at you. Have... You can't handle 12 year old by yourself. Come on. That's why you need this little thing on me, and that's why you need one, two, three, four, five cops. Come on. What the f did I do? You're acting like, like a an adult child. Exactly. Throwing a tantrum, kicking, and I'm throwing yourself on the floor. That's I'm great. 12. Well, obviously, you want to be treated like an adult. Exactly. So take it off me. I'm being no. respectful. I'm telling you to take it off me. Oh, you're telling me to do that? It doesn't work that way. Okay, and you're telling me it doesn't work that way. This is hurting my hips. All right, come on. You want to be treated like a, a, a real child? Let's put you in there like a real child. Come on. No. Come on. I'll fall. I can't Let's walk if you're pulling me. Since they couldn't persuade her to calmly enter the vehicle, the officers decided to wrap Catherine up. Get on your knees. No. Well, we'll put you there. Right. You brought this on yourself, young lady. Is this your baby as well? Stop. Because I, 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 I saw that too. Here's the phone helmet. No. Why are you guys doing this to me? I can't even see. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Like, I'm at the point that I want to figure out to put something together because it's been such a living hell. Like, I How even... How many times has she get charged? She's with assault on you guys? Yes, uh, Three times already. Yeah. But 
three times. And, and on me, she's had batteries about four times because kids like this that continue to do this, and every single time they get a class with juvenile citation and they throw it off, these kids start calling you guys bluff and start like, why do I have this? Okay, I'm going to do shit. There's nothing you can do anyway. And that's where they start shooting people, breaking into cars, vandalizing homes, doing all this kind of stuff because they get away with it. The juvenile system here sucks. So what happened today with the fight? I'm sorry. It's better. Everything was fine. And um, he started throwing food. He started throwing food. Alex. Okay. So, you know, Alex is the girl. Boy, I okay. don't know. It's confusing. He came outside, like, to, like, look for me. And, like, he kind of started, like, trying to make himself look bigger, I guess, mm -hmm. or whatever. Like, and then that's when, like, I pushed him back. Mm -hmm. And then that's when he went straight for right here. And then he went for my hair. And then that's when I hit so him back. When you say you pushed him, you went, you say, when you say you went for right here, like, what do you mean went for right here? Like, he went, clawed me in the face. Okay. And he went, clawed me in the face, he grabbed a hold of my hair, like, he kind of had me, like, he had me by my hip, like, mm -hmm. he was holding me by my hip, and, like, he had me by the back of my hair, like, by, by my ponytail, mm -hmm. and then he had me, he scratched me in the, the eye, and I was hitting him, like, trying to, like, push him off and hit him, mm -hmm. and then that's when, um, the security guard, that's when he came, and then that's when he grabbed me, and that's when I was asking him to let me go, mm -hmm. I wasn't going to hit him or nothing, I was kind of, like, I don't like being held mm -hmm. down, like, not held down, but I don't like being held like that, right. like, so it was just, I just started freaking out because I don't like being held like that, so. So, what happened with that thing? I saw a group of students hanging out right up by the west side. Then I saw Mia and another student that were confrontational verbal. Mm -hmm. They punch you? Mm-hmm. Where at? I just hit her on, but she just she, went. She hit you, though. Yeah, and then I yeah. cut it out, and then. She got confrontational with And then I, I restrained her. She got confrontational with you or the other person? I'm sorry. With everybody. She got confrontational with, with, with everybody? With everybody. Okay. I had to restrain her again okay. and she started kicking me right from kicking the back. You? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lenny had to restrain her, her leg because she was just out of control. So this is Alex, a 16-year-old transgender who threw food at students in the cafeteria. And when one student protested, the argument escalated into a physical fight. Then teachers and security intervened, but Alex attacked them too, scratching and hitting them in the eyes. Because of this, Alex has already earned multiple battery charges. The police are now going to talk to him, but they'll immediately encounter a problem. Alex believes he hasn't done anything wrong and that he's too young to go to jail, so he'll become aggressive and resist right away. Okay. All right, Mia. Or Alex, I'm sorry. Go ahead, stand up. You're making me anxiety. I don't need clothes and your freaking officers in here. We have to do, we're just working. No, I don't need you guys in here. You're making me get anxiety. And still, I don't care. I don't want y'all in here. Y'all making me anxiety. Alex, Alex. Y'all making me have anxiety. Y'all need to get that through your head. I'm getting anxiety from them. They're about to detain you. They're going to put the cuffs on you. They For what? You gonna can't, you know, they're going to take me to jail. That's they can't. No, you're not. And they have to. They have to. No. They have to. Nope. They're not doing it because they want to. They actually have to. No, they don't. So you, Alex. We're not asking you. You, you have to. No. Okay? No. So I'm, I'm going to ask you one more time, okay? I'm not going with y'all. Right? have my mom take me. To. I don't need to go with y'all. Can y'all stop being let me go with y'all? I don't want to go with y'all. You have to. I don't want to. You have to. I'll meet you there. No. What the f*** did I do? Alex. I didn't do shit. Get you all the no, what did I do? What did I do? That's not me. You should go take her to jail. It's both y'all. No, it's not me. No, it wasn't. It's just not that's not how it is. Alex, Alex. don't do that. Yes, because y'all be trying to take me to jail. No, I'm not going to jail. We have to go with us. Y'all trying to take me to jail? No, I'm too young. I'm too young to go to jail. Y'all didn't understand. No, I'm not going to jail. No, just not. Okay, just, just real quick, okay? I, I can see that you're very upset right now. I don't blame you. Okay, the the youngest that we can detain a person. You're not detaining. Listen, listen, that's not what it is. No. Is 11 years old. Okay. I don't care. You're not detaining me. Get that three head. I don't want to go. Alex. I don't want. I don't want to go. I understand that. Listen, mm. let me let me let me explain this real quick. If if you refuse and you try to fight with us, or you refuse. Well, can y'all just feed me quiet and just leave me alone? We can't do that. Listen. Well, stop trying to take me with y'all. I'm not trying to go. It doesn't matter with y'all either. You have to go no, it doesn't matter. No, it doesn't. So can you please no, take off your backpack? No. Okay. I'm not taking my s. Okay. 
No. No. This is my shit. Stop. 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 No. Stop. Don't touch me. Please. No. No. Please. I'm sorry. No. 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 Stop. Please. Stop. I know you will. Well, can you but just it's going to make it more comfortable for I don't you. need it. No, it's not comfortable. Okay. Ow! Oh, no! Listen. Oh my god, bro. You're breath. making it stressed out. You're making me get sick. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. I can't breathe, bro. You're bre do you have asthma? <laughs> yeah, yes. Oh, You're have an inhaler. I don't have an inhaler. As soon as we get, get you to the PD, <laughs> then we're going to release you. Okay? And then you can go with mama. I can't breathe. Oh, I can't breathe. Here, hold, hold, hold the backpack. <laughs> hold on, Alex. I want to stand here, please. Huh? Do you have any weapons on you? No. Nothing that's going to poke, cut, or stab in your pockets? Uh, ow. I have to ask. Can you spread your feet for me, no. please? No. Alex. Alex. No, leave me alone. Can't please. Stand right here for no. me. No. Alex, you have to. No. I, I got to check you. No, I please. Alex, you just said check you. Alex, no, Alex. please. The age of the individual involved does impact how the case is handled by the legal system, but being under 18 does not exempt someone from detention. Under New Mexico law, the police can take a juvenile into custody if there are grounds to believe the juvenile has committed a delinquent act. And since Alex is violent and attacked multiple people, cops have grounds to detain and arrest him. Alex will continue to cause trouble because he doesn't want to be searched. He's hiding something, but he doesn't realize that it's harmless. Ow! Alex, Ow! If it's a, if it's like a Wait. vape, I don't care. Yes. Okay, you can't. I'm not gonna charge you with that. That's it. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get it. Okay. Uh, see, that's all you have to do. I know you don't like cops. Yeah. And I understand, but I want you to understand we're not doing anything to try to hurt. Go ahead and sit down for me. Let's do that. Okay. You got it. Yeah. Okay. So we got a report that there was a fight. Um, they by the time we got there, they were separated. Yeah. So both Alex and the other person, the other person was 18, they're an adult, so they're handled differently. Mm -hmm. But they're going to be something's going to happen with them as well. Yeah. So Alex, <clears throat> she's being charged with the uh, battery against the school personnel, two counts, um, public affray, and resisting, evading, obstructing. So the situation pretty much is, is I picked her up and I took her to like run errands all over town. Uh -huh. um, she told me that she was going to stay with a friend here, so I brought her. Um, so I brought her here. She was trying to get a hold of the friend. The friend wouldn't answer. Finally, he did. He said that he was like two hours away. So I said, okay, cool. Like, you can either stay here with your stuff or I'll take you to McDonald's and do it with him, for him there. She didn't want to do either or. I said, well, you need to start calling like friends, family, whoever, you know, to try to figure out like, where you're going to stay. She's like, I don't have anybody. And I'm like, dude, I don't know what to tell you. So I'm kind of like stuck because she doesn't have any money. She cashed it on Friday. Um, she said she stayed at one hotel Friday and then she stayed with a friend. She ended up getting arrested, I believe, on Sunday. 
for a warrant that she had out and a battery on an officer as well. What's her name? Deja. Ah, yeah, I know who she is. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know what to do with her. And I my bosses, you. I can't stay with her all night, obviously. Yeah, yeah. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing at all? Later. All right. You don't need to talk to me, but you do need to get out of the car. All right. She needs mm -hmm. to take off. Okay. All right. Later. Get away from me. Right. Now. Get out of the car. Can you get... Yeah, I'll move out the way. But well, you're going to get out the car. Goodbye. Just unbuckle and get out, ma'am. No. You can't stay in here. I already asked to go back to the CYD office. That is all I need to say to you. How Goodbye. old are you? Eight. How old are you? Oh, Deja, you're the one that got arrested at. You. We don't need to go that way. Yeah, we don't, don't need know to me, go that way. And I don't know you. Yeah, you don't know me. Okay. So don't try but to I know you're 18. You know I know you're 18. I'm not 18. You got that wrong. All right, how old are you? Doesn't matter. How old are you? How old are you? Doesn't matter. Are you? Doesn't matter. All right, what's your name and date of birth? Why? I have a lawful reason right now to identify who you are because you're not getting out of a state vehicle and they requested I am a me CY here. Okay, then if you get the f out of here and get the f away, I'll step out of the f car. I step back for you. I just bought your last name. I don't know. You really want to go to jail? No, for I'm trying to identity? step out of the car. Okay, I'll unbuckle and I'll step out of get the way. Him. I'll step out of the way, but you need to start unbuckling now. No, you need to back the f I'm telling you right now, Deja, you're not in charge right now. No, I need you to back right. up and respect my space. Okay, I'm not in your space. I'm telling you right now. Get this the All right. away from so, me. So, go ahead and start unbuckling now. There's no need for threats. There's no need for you to be here or for you to try oh. to talk to me, okay? I was, I was Goodbye. Called out here. I was called out here. Nah. This is Deja, and she refuses to leave Alicia's car. Alicia is her caseworker, and she went out of her way and drove her wherever she wanted, but Deja decided to cause trouble unnecessarily anyway. As you can see, she can't stand the police because she's already had trouble with the law, but what awaits her next is something she couldn't have dreamed of in her worst nightmare. She will continue her rude behavior, and the officer will be extremely tolerant until she starts waving her hands around his head. So I'm telling you right now, you're getting out of that vehicle one way or another. I'll get out of the vehicle when I'm ready to get out of the vehicle. No, you're going to get out gone. now. Alicia, get him the f away from She's me. the one that contacted me, so she needs my help. So Deja, go ahead and unbuckle and get out. Unbuckled. Now leave. The f it. out of my face. Get out. No, I need you to get the f away from me. I did. I stepped back enough. No, you did not. Yes, I did. Deja, I'm going to tell you right now, you're going to get out of the vehicle. For what? Because y'all trying to arrest me for what I'm this not time? arresting you. I'm just telling you, you, she doesn't want you in her vehicle. So you need to get out of the vehicle. And I don't want you near me. You're not staying in the vehicle, Deja. Yeah, leave. Deja, get your stuff and get out of the no. vehicle. No. I'm going to give you one more choice, all right? And I'm going to go to my car. I'm, up. I'm telling you right what? now, Deja, get out of the way. I am out of okay. the way. Go over there. No. Okay, fool. so I'm going to walk to my patrol unit go right there. Go the f ahead. I don't care. Get all your stuff and get out. Get out no. of the car before I physically do it. You don't need to physically get yes, me out I of the will. car if I've been out of the car. Okay, so move so I can close the door no. and get out of it. I'm going to no. walk away for now, but when I come back... I don't f***ing care. When I, when I come get back, out! I'm don't stand right to me, Get the f*** away! Don't put your f***ing hand get in my the face. Get the f*** out of I'm my gonna face. Right now. Don't touch me and don't put your hand I in my face. I ain't touching you, I'm telling you right now, don't put your hand in my face. Alright? What the f*** that? Okay. So now... Get out of the car. Don't touch her! Get out of the car. Get out of the car. I told you, what? Don't get in the car.
I'm not. Do not. No. Put, put your foot in. Can you please put tell me what's in. actually going on? No, I'm not going to do that until you put your foot in. Huh? I'm going to give you one last opportunity. Can you actually tell me what's going on? Not until you comply with the game. No, no, no. As you can see, the rap is already prepared. After she refused to get into two different police vehicles after kicking and hitting the officers, they simply have no other choice but to completely wrap her up. Usually, suspects calm down when the police restrain them in this manner, but not Deja. Her behavior will get worse and worse. Now it's time for the hospital check to see if she injured herself during her rampage. like a grown adult. I like a grown adult to stop screaming and I'll let her come to the window so you could talk to her. You understand? Do you understand? Calm yourself. Stop stop yelling. Act like an adult and I'll bring her over here. No you're not. You're still screaming. I will bring her over here if you just calm down and act like an adult. You're in my care now. I'm not in your care. Yeah you are. You're in my custody. And you assaulted me. You're in my custody now. You had no right to No it's not acting like this I don't want to leave her in this yeah in this forever so I like to get her as if possible straight to the DC I need to be seen by the hospital no Brian no I want to go to the hospital you were actually just discharged from the hospital you did not even let me talk to them they checked you out what do you mean they didn't even check my head they checked all of you you didn't no, want to I comply didn't. You're going to the jail. Why do you think this is okay? What did I do to you? Huh? I want to press charges. And I want to go to the hospital for medical attention. Get away from me. Get away from me. Get him away. Deja was charged with concealing identity, resisting arrest, and battery on a law enforcement officer. Ma'am. Okay. No, it's okay. I'm, you're not in trouble. I just want to talk to you, ma'am. Is that okay? I just want to make sure everything's all right. We can talk under the shade, ma'am. It's okay. You're not in trouble whatsoever. She just threw 
threw everything. She broke everything. You look at the bathroom, she just put over everything over. Like, so what happened today, ma'am? She just... What's wrong with you? She's like, leave me the phone! And she just started going crazy, right? And then, ten minutes later, and that's when I heard her throwing everything around. The police were called due to a domestic dispute, but they surely didn't expect to encounter such chaos. A girl named Ariel had a sudden tantrum and started destroying things around the family house where she once lived. Her mother is the one who called for help, and she truly needs it, because this isn't the first time. Ariel had previously had outbursts during which she smashed windows around the house and made threats, but this time her mother has had enough and thus wants to ban her daughter from ever entering the property again. Um, reason I'm here is I guess you just had a little argument over there at your house. Is everything okay? Yes. So what happened? She just walked in and she got mad at me. Who walked in? My mom, that's it, that's all. That's it. Oh, okay, so it's just you and your mom? Yeah. How long has she been living here, mom? Uh, she doesn't live here, she lives with her boyfriend. Oh, okay, so she was just staying at your house for like a little Yeah, bit. no, she, she just came. My dad will let her come here sometimes to shower or to eat, and that's it. When was the last time she did live here, though? Um, It's been a long time. It's been probably like five or six years. Would you like her trespass from the property? Okay, if she's trespassed from the property, you guys cannot allow her back for any reason and yeah. violate that trespassing because yeah. then she can get arrested. Yeah, good. We need to do that because it's Would getting be bad. Something? She's broken the windows before to get in. Okay. All she does is steal from us and rip us off, and it's awful. A nightmare okay. we have to deal with. You want to tell me what happened? Nothing happened. No? I just left. That's yes. all. Okay. Who's, uh, who's at home? Nobody, she keeps going back and forth, and I don't know why, I just got out the shower. Okay, who's she, mom? Yes. Okay. <laughs> you just left? She didn't kick you out? Yes. What are you guys arguing about? Nothing. Nothing? I don't know, we're just fighting, that's it. You just want to be there, or what? No. Okay, so since she doesn't live here, and she's not a household member. Mm -hmm. Would you like to pursue charges for the criminal damage to property? Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, you didn't tell her. You just left. You didn't tell her anything. Uh, no. What are you? <laughs> <laughs> no. Why did? <laughs> oh, What's leave going me on? alone. Hey, relax. Relax. <laughs> just chill out for us. <laughs> Trying to make sure you're okay, Ariel. I'm okay, and my foot well, can't free be free to go on. Why do you keep crying then? Because of what you guys stop me for. You guys were supposed to go to the house. Why do you guys stop me for? She called you guys to go talk to her. So, what else happened, Ariel? Nothing has happened! Okay, how long have you been living there for? They're, they're talking to mom right now, right? trying to talk to you, okay? You can't leave yet. Get away from me! What's your problem? What'd you take, Ariel? I didn't take nothing! What the hell are you talking why about? Are you, why are you acting like this? I'm not acting like nothing! Am My mom called school? you to go to 23 months of this stuff. Someone's why over there did already. you stop me? Because we saw you and someone else is over there already. Well, nobody is over there! I just, just walked over from there. over there! They just went over there right now. I just walked from over there. I am not the one. Quit looking at me like I'm a cat. Stop. You guys are scaring me. Stop. What are you doing, Ariel? What are you having there? Nothing. Stay out of my business. You're rather disrespectful, bro. Why? Ugh, leave me alone! 
There we go. Turn around. There we go. There we go. Turn around. Give me your hands. Give me your hands out from under you. All right, Ariel, you're gonna be cool, right? Okay, let's get up. Come on. I'll help you up. Come on. Are you injured anywhere? Watch your step. Step up, face that car. Move your feet apart. You have nothing on you that's gonna poke me, stick me, hurt me? Uh, no. no? Okay. Come on now. You step out from here quick. After this incident, Ariel was charged with criminal damage to property, resisting arrest and battery on a law enforcement officer. She also got trespassed from her family house.